everyone, it's Miss Chris. I'm sorry I'm so late. Um, very busy day today. Um, I'm gonna read a different story. I said maybe we had a guest, but um, I saw this book on the desk and I said they really like this book. So I'm gonna read this story. And for all of you in our class, we know what story this is. It is The Napping House. And I'm going to read it. We're not going to listen to the CD. So, The Napping House by Audrey Wood and Don Wood. And they wrote the story together and they also drew the pictures. Front cover, spine, spine holds the book together. And the back cover, and that's the title page. The title page tells us three things. The author, the illustrator, and the title of our story. And he said the title of our story is Napping House. And it's written and illustrated by Audrey Wood and Don Wood. You ready? There is a house, a napping house, where everyone is sleeping. Look, it's raining. It's what kind of time of day is it? And in that house, there is a bed, a cozy bed, and a napping house where everyone is sleeping. See who's sleeping? And on that bed, there is a granny, a snoring granny, on a cozy bed in a napping house where everyone is sleeping. It's still raining outside. And on that granny, there is a child, a dreaming child, on a snoring granny, on a cozy bed, in a napping house, where everyone is sleeping. You see? He's sleeping on his granny. I wonder who's going to be on the bed next. And on that child, there is a dog, a dozing dog, on a dreaming child, on a snoring granny, on a cozy bed, in a napping house where everyone is sleeping. Look at the bed. Just pay attention to the bed. I wonder who's going to be on the bed next. And on that dog, there is a cat, a snoozing cat, on a dozing dog, on a dreaming child, on a snoring granny, on a cozy bed in a napping house where everyone is sleeping. Look at the bed. I wonder what's going to happen. I wonder who's going to go in the bed next. And on that cat, there is a mouse, a slumbering mouse, on a snoozing cat, on a dozing dog, on a dreaming child, on a snoring granny, on a cozy bed, in a napping house where everyone is sleeping. Let's look at the bed. Pay attention to the window outside. I wonder who is going to be next. And on that mouse, there is a flea. Can it be a wakeful flea on a slumbering mouse, on a snoozing cat, on a dozing dog, on a dreaming child, on a snoring granny? on a cozy bed, in a napping house, where everyone is sleeping. Look at the bed. Mm, let's see what's gonna happen next. A wakeful flea who bites the mouse. Uh oh, there's the flea and he bit the mouse. Who scares the cat? Oh my goodness, what is going on now? It seems like everyone is waking up. Who claws the dog? Oh no. Who thumps the child? Now look at the background. Oh, I wonder what's gonna happen. Who bumps the granny? Oh, they bumped the granny and the granny went up in the air. Look at all 
the characters in the story, they're everywhere. Who breaks the bed? Uh-oh, their bed is broken. And look at outside now. Is it raining anymore? Is it nighttime anymore? No. In a napping house where no one now is sleeping. You see? It's now sunny. There is a rainbow. And they're all outside. Well, we hope you like this story. Um, everyone is safe. Uh, we miss you. We love you. Uh, we hope you have your listening ears and your helping hands with your gentle touches, your soft touches. And we hope to see you real, real soon. Bye-bye.